Yo, what's going on guys? It's Cynical and welcome back to another Kingdom Hearts 3 news and information video. Today for you guys, we got a scoop. We got a juicy scoop, ladies and gentlemen. So, very recently, a Twitter user that goes by the name of Rob Lloyd recently data mined an upcoming update for Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Now, this data mine shows us a bunch of upcoming new spirit parts that will soon be put into the game, along with some new avatar parts. Now, within this data mine, it revealed to us exactly what Kyrie's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit is going to look like. Now, obviously, it's not going to be precise from detail to detail as we would see it in a Kingdom Hearts 3 trailer, but as a base concept, this is pretty much what we can expect. Now we will get into Kairi's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit in just a sec, but let's take a look at the other things that was data mined. These right here are a bunch of brand new spirit parts that will soon be arriving to the game. Uh, we have the Pony Star right here, which I assume means that we are soon going to be able to have ponies as pets, so for anyone who's into the whole pony thing, there you go, Pony Star is coming soon. On top of that, we also have some Lion King accessories to accessorize our pets with, which is super cool. This would mark the very first time that the Lion King property has made its way into Union Cross. But aside from new spirit parts, we've also got some brand new avatar parts as well, and again, it seems to be that Square Enix are focusing on the Lion King theme. So yes, we've got some Lion King avatar parts. Uh, these are them right here. We've got a main, which I assume will be a headpiece, which is pretty interesting. You know, it's seen a bunch of Keyblade wielders walking around with manes on. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit different. It also looks like we're going to be receiving some Lion King Snugglies as well. We've got the Timon Snuggly, we have the Baby Simba Snuggly, along with the Baby Nala Snuggly. However, though, it's not just new Lion King avatar parts that will be coming to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, but Kingdom Hearts 3 outfits. And this is where Kyrie's brand new Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit comes into play. So this data mine has presented to us what is Kyrie's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit and this is it right here, obviously within a Kingdom Hearts Union Cross style. So in terms of depicting it from detail to detail, it's going to be quite hard in comparison to obviously seeing it within a Kingdom Hearts 3 trailer, but this is basically the basis of what Kyrie's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit is going to look like in the game. Now previously, we have actually seen what Kyrie's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit might potentially look like, although it was confirmed by Tetsuya Nomura that the outfit that Kyrie's wearing within the Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Cross third anniversary art isn't actually her finalized outfit, but more so of a concept as to what her Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit will end up looking like. And really, we didn't actually get to see a great deal of this concept outfit within the art. The only real differences that we were seeing in this concept outfit was Kairi's hood that she was wearing. As the hood she's wearing here looks a little bit different compared to the hood that's on her Kingdom Hearts 2 outfit. It's got this kind of black lining on it along with some what looks to be cat ears on top. And so looking at this finalized Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit from Union Cross, it looks to be that, yeah, they use that outfit that we saw within the anniversary art as a basis, but it's definitely not what we saw within the anniversary art. However, though, I gotta say that I definitely like the look of this design, uh, opposed to Kairi wearing that kind of very short dress that she was wearing in Kingdom Hearts 2. It looks to be that in Kingdom Hearts 3, she's covering up a little bit more. At first glance, though, when I was looking at this outfit, this really tells me that Kairi is suiting up for battle. We, of course, know that at the end of Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop distance, Kairi is now training alongside Lee under Merlin to properly learn how to use the Keyblade, and we can only assume that within Kingdom Hearts 3, in some sort of shape or form, Kairi will be involved in a few combat situations. After all, she has a Keyblade, so she should probably use it, right? Again, we have the play design going on. It seems to be that the play design is what Tetsuya Nomura is focusing on when it comes to the new character outfits for Kingdom Hearts 3. Essentially, at this point, out of all of the new character outfits that we've seen, Played seems to be the design that Tetsuya Nomura is focusing on. And again, we can see that here with Kairi's brand new outfit. Although we actually don't get to see too much Played right here, we see it on the sort of end of the skirt on the right side, and I guess a little bit where the armholes are, but aside from that, it's actually quite low-key when it comes to the Played. However, though, I have to say that I really, really like this design, and I want to go as far to say that this is most likely the best outfit that 
that Kyrie has probably received throughout the series so far. I'm loving the use of more black against the outfit opposed to having it pretty much all pink. The black against pink looks really really good and definitely suits Kyrie as a character. Also buttons, it seems to be that buttons are a present detail on this outfit as well and not just on Kyrie's outfit but pretty much for all of the new character outfits in Kingdom Hearts 3. It's not just played that we're going for but also buttons so yeah we got buttons on this bad boy. Now because this is a data mine it means that this content will soon be arriving in Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, likely that it will arrive in the Japanese version first and then not too long after the global version will receive this. So it's likely that we will see this content extremely soon but this leads me to believe that with revealing Kairi's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit through an avatar part within Union Cross, Perhaps maybe with the new Kingdom Hearts 3 trailers that we'll hopefully be receiving next month, it's likely that we might actually end up seeing Kairi in one of those trailers wearing this brand new outfit. But anyway guys, that's pretty much all for today's news and information, some very very exciting stuff on top of Kairi's outfit being avatar parts for Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, Sora's Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit is also coming to Union Cross as avatar parts as well, so we can only cross our fingers that Riku's will hopefully be coming some time soon as well. In the comment section down below guys, let me know your thoughts and opinions towards Kyrie's brand new Kingdom Hearts 3 outfit. I would love to know what you guys are thinking. How guys, with all that being said, I've been Cynical. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastic day and until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Hit him on a page, you'll be coming through stunning. Go dip my mouth when you suckers be bluffing. Milk crack, gaming up your bitch though. Catch me in the back, playing Super Nintendo.